Hey, I'm Dr. Sri Ganesh, uh, Chairman and Managing Director of Nethudama Hospitals Private Limited. And I have been in practice for the past 25 years. And uh, I have done over one lakh uh, cataract surgeries. Cataract is one of the commonest problems that we see in ophthalmology. Uh, it is a cause for reversible blindness. Everyone has a natural uh, crystalline lens in the eye, which is responsible for focusing objects from distance, intermediate and near. With age, this lens uh, undergoes denaturation, there's clumping of the protein and uh, reduced light entering uh, into the eye, which causes blurring of vision, and this is cataract. Cataract is not a disease per se, but it's a naturally occurring phenomenon with age. Cataract is responsible for uh, painless, gradual loss of vision. The initial sta stages of cataract, uh, the patient may have symptoms like mild blurring of vision. Cataract can also cause frequent change of glasses. And uh, sometimes in older patients, uh, what happens is uh, they're able to see well for near, but the distance vision reduces. Early cataract can cause some symptoms because of scattering of light. Commonest are halos where uh, there are circles around light, especially when it is pitch dark and you're seeing a point source of light like a, a bulb or a, a car headlamp, then you can see a circle around the light. There can also be glare, which is reflected light, which causes disturbance, and starburst, which is like flashes of light. And there can also be colored halos, wherein you see circles of light, but different colors. And these are the very early uh, symptoms of uh, cataract and can cause difficulty in night vision, driving, etc. Once a cataract is diagnosed, the only treatment for cataract is surgical removal of the cataract. There is no established medical treatment for cataract like drops or medicines. Uh, if you look at surgery, there are basically three varieties of surgery to remove the cataract. One is the manual surgery wherein a very large incision is made and the cataract is removed either with or without uh, stitches. The other is a micro incision cataract surgery wherein through a small incision the cataract is emulsified and broken up with ultrasound and removed. The third is the latest and most advanced technique known as uh, femto laser assisted cataract surgery which is a robotic surgery wherein a laser, a femtosecond laser is used to make incisions uh, to access the cataract and also to break up the cataract into small pieces. And this has a very high degree of uh, accuracy, a very precise and a safe procedure. These are foldable intraocular lenses which are inserted through a very small incision. Now in the foldable lenses also you have three varieties. Uh, you have monofocal lenses, you have multifocal lenses, and you have the extended depth of field lenses. So with the monofocal lenses, basically there's a single focus, and these lenses can either be fixed for distance or for near, and usually we focus, we set the focus for distance, and the patient will have to wear reading glasses for intermediate and near. So they are not able to see anything for near or intermediate, and they have to wear either bifocal or progressive glasses. Now, if you go in for a multifocal lenses, these multifocal lenses have multiple foci which focus for distance and for near, and the newer lenses also focus for intermediate. So the patient is able to reduce their dependence on glasses and almost be rid of glasses, and it's a permanent correction, and they can do all the normal activities without glasses. The quality of vision also is very good in today's lenses. The third variety is the extended depth of field lenses, which is a special technology which has a continuous range of focus for distance to intermediate and near. Uh, if the patient wants to read very small print with extended depth of field, then sometimes they may require uh, reading glasses. But by and large, these lenses reduce the dependence on the glasses for everyday life. Plus, they also give a very high quality of uh, vision and night vision. In earlier days, uh, patients used to wait until the cataract used to be mature because there was a large incision, the cataract used to be removed as a whole. But nowadays with modern micro incision techniques, we have to cut the cataract into small pieces and aspirate it or remove it through a very small opening. 
and if the cataract becomes very dense then it becomes more difficult to do it takes more time and then there's more collateral damage and delayed recovery and your eyes are your most precious organs so it is better to go in for the best of technology and the best of intraocular lenses because this is something that is going to serve you for a lifetime it's not like a shirt which okay you don't like it after a few days or it gets soiled you can just discard it and wear another one but this is something that is going to stay with you for life so it's better to opt for the best uh, treatments